Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for the 24th. Um, we're going to use this deck right here to get three cards for an overall energy, and then we're going to use the vice versa deck. And I just picked this deck up and shuffled it a little bit, and we come up with the this is the Emperor Reverse. That's what I when I decided I was going to turn the camera on, I just put the deck down, and and here we are. So we have this Emperor with his back turned. Um, you know, it's like he, he's thrown down the match, right? He's thrown, it's like he's not interested. Something, something's going on here. This, uh, it's like he's not taking it or he's not interested. He may be really focused on something else. Um, maybe he doesn't know. We, th we could have this person who doesn't know that something is about to blow up. He may not know that something is about to catch on fire or something like that. He may not be aware because he's too focused on something else. So this is the emperor is a masculine. It's a very strong, dominant energy. This person, um, he builds an empire. And it looks like he's focused on something, not knowing that something could, you know, get out of control. Something could get out of control. Um, he may he may want to uh, pay more attention. He may not be aware that, you know, <laughs> something is about to happen. Something is about to catch on fire or explode or something like that. Um, hmm. Maybe he's ignoring a situation. Maybe he knows that you know, something is about to happen and he's ignoring it. Maybe it's meant to happen. Maybe something is meant to happen. He's got a lot of wisdom behind him and inside of him. So who knows what's going on here. But anyway, let's get some of these. We're going to get overall energy. Deceit. Well, what a great way to start out the day, huh? We have some deceit. You know, uh, looks a little shady to me. It looks scary. Deception. That's a seven, too. Um, all is not as it seems. Put it that way. Beware. All is not as it seems. There's something going on behind those curtains, and it looks something, but I think it's going to be revealed because the curtain is open. So, some sort of deception may be revealed. All right. You can only hide it for so long. So, something that has been hidden is going to be revealed. Ooh, angel of love. So, it looks as though there's some sort of protection here. This is angel protection. Interesting. Angel of Love. Hmm. Temple Path. This is somebody that is going down a new path. It's like their prayers have been answered. Somebody is taking a different path. It's almost they're looking for more peace and contentment. And you know, I you know, it's funny I, what I just saw when I saw these three, I saw orbs. And and I don't know what it is. They're like but when I looked at this card just now, I I saw orbs. So I think there is some universal protection. There could be even some like there's somebody around, somebody that has a spirit or somebody that has passed or angels or whatever that is is helping so we have some we have some universal help here something is about to be revealed there's there's some sort of protection or guidance or angels or spirits or something around that are revealing something they're helping to reveal something Interesting. Now we're going to shuffle. And there's stuff on both sides. <clears throat> so we 
we're just going to see six of pentacles. This is reevaluation, reevaluating. This is somebody that is looking down, looking down and seeing everything. <laughs> you know, I don't know what the hell this is. It's almost, I mean, I saw this card. I just saw this is somebody that's looking down, like still looking down from above. I know that's not the meaning of the card, but then again, I never really do go by, by, by the meaning of the cards now, do I? Sometimes I do, sometimes I don't. This is receiving something. Somebody is going to be receiving something. And it's from somebody or a entity that is out of this world. What, and I know that's hard to fathom, but that is what this is. These have them on both sides, so we don't need to we don't need to do reverse. There's the side on each meaning uh, meaning for each side. So we have the Empress, we have the Hierophant, we have Judgment, and we have the Ten of Swords. So this looks painful. It looks like I mean this is this is a betrayal. This is the end. Ten of Swords is the end. The end of deception. The end of betrayal. This is absolution. This is judgment day. This is divine guidance. No joke. This is a higher power. The high priestess, higher power. I'm telling you what, there's somebody, I believe, from above, whether it's an angel or it's a spirit guide or it's God or it's somebody that has passed away that is, could, that is helping. Could be a mother, could be a father with that emperor. Could be a grandmother, could be a whatever. Could be an ancestor. I don't know who it is. Could be an angel. I don't know who it is. But this is somebody that has passed away as well. If you were to look this card up, judgment is somebody that is, we got somebody on the other side that is here. They are here. And I got the goosebumps. <laughs> and they are trying to get somebody to listen, to have faith and trust. This is, an, this is the birth of a new life. This is a resurrection. This is an absolution. This could be a reconciliation. These angels are trying to get somebody to follow their heart. Who, if it's an angel or somebody that's passed away. Could be. This is past life. So I, uh, it's, I, I, I feel like it is somebody that has passed away. I think it's a mother or, or it's a father. Could be a mother or a father because the emperor is the father and the empress is the mother. Um, we have this queen of, <laughs> got the goosebumps so strong. The queen of wands, this is a queen of wands reverse. This is, this is, uh, it could be a mother, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, I don't know. This could be you in this lifetime. This could be you that is contemplating shutting down, okay? We have somebody here that is thinking about um, a new approach, thinking about what they need to leave behind, thinking about the mess that has been created, Um We definitely have somebody here that is going within to contemplate and think. They've got themselves in quite a mess. Somebody has got themselves in quite a mess. But anyway, um, let's get back to these. I wanted to make sure that this was focused in. It looks as though somebody is receiving some sort of guidance from above. This is an opportunity for a new life. This is the birth of a new life. This is this is the goddess of love, for the angel of love. It's like there's an opportunity for extreme, abundant love here. You notice that star? This is a dream come true. This is wish fulfillment. There's an opportunity to... Get what you've been with. This is what you've been wishing for. 
Somebody could be dealing with a Taurus. This is Taurus. This is Taurus. This is Scorpio. We also have Libra. But there's a couple Tauruses. But anyway, this is a this is a believe in yourself. Listen. Listen. That's what he's saying when his hand is up. Listen. Are you listening? It's, it's, this is a wake-up call. This is an epiphany. This is the truth being revealed. Some There's going to be some sort of secret or truth or revelation or something. Something is about to happen. That is going to lead somebody down a new path. And wherever this path leads to, it does lead to love because we have this divine guidance that is trying to bring love into whatever this situation is. She is the goddess of love. But anyway, this is judgment day. This is an this is an awakening. There's some some there's been some sort of uh, painful situation that is absolutely coming to an end. Absolution end. Something is absolutely coming to an end. Could be a commitment. Could be a marriage. I'm just being honest with you. Doesn't have to be a marriage, but it's some sort of commitment. I don't know. Anyhow, let's get some more cards. And this is this is uh, getting something. You get what you give. You reap what you sow. So. Somebody is receiving something, whatever that is. Wish fulfillment. I said, look at that star. Imagine that. Isn't that funny? And now we got the star underneath it. This is the star card. It's amazing how that happens, don't you think? Anyhow. Ooh. Something's going to happen really, really fast. This is rapid, okay? There's going to be forward movement. It's going to happen very quickly. There's going to be some sort of message that comes in. Whatever this message is, it may hurt, okay? It may hurt, considering the card that it's underneath. It may hurt that you may read, somebody may receive word about, you know... somebody leaving I mean I just gotta be honest with you here we have the world card this is the end okay after the truth after the acceptance after this awakening after this epiphany this, something is going to end a lesson is going to be learned a phase is, is, is coming to an end somebody is completing one stage of their life. It was a very prominent stage. There could be some sort of reunion or reconciliation. Just being honest with you, there absolutely could be. We have somebody here that has been thinking about um, love, thinking about what to do next, thinking about what has been lost, really, really in a state of, you know, deep, deep thought, wondering, you know, what, 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 what they really want, what, what their wish fulfillment is thinking about what love is so yeah we definitely have somebody here that is really really thinking about you know what they want and I have to tell you if you have been praying you've been praying for something your prayers are, have been heard and they're going to be answered three 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 your prayers have been heard and this is the answer to your prayers so I feel as though somebody's prayers are being answered. Whatever whatever they are, that somebody's prayers are being I'm telling you what. I mean three three three, your prayers are being answered. Now this is a card of forgiveness. It's a card of um acceptance and absolution, which I know I'm repeating myself, but I feel like somebody may be communicating and coming forth with the truth and you know, asking for forgiveness. 
that could certainly happen for some of you. There's been some lies. There's been some deception, no doubt. But it's like the truth can no longer be hidden. This is The truth is coming out. This has been a long time coming. And this is yin and yang. And I could say yin and yang and get pinged for that. Because sometimes, you know, I talk so fast that I forget to drop the G. I know it's yin. I just, I'm talking. So yes, there's a perfect match here. There's been a lot of opposition. There's been probably some, um, there may have been a third party situation. There's been a lot of pain. But this is healing. Somebody could be dealing with somebody who, you know, is a star. There is, they could, there is, they're, they're a star, you know. This is, a, this is somebody who shines very, very, very brightly. Anyway. This is a card of a dream. This is wish fulfillment, a dream come true. And the threes of prayer has been answered. This is the prayers. So we have somebody whose prayers are about to be answered. And you can thank somebody for, from above because they've heard your prayers. This is, this is a celebration. This is, you know, happiness. This is some sort of renewal. We got a serious renewal here. Renewal, renewal, renewal. We have a renewal here. Uh, it's like a new life. We have a, this is a new life. This is that phoenix rising from the ashes. We have a new life about to begin because one, one stage, one phase, one prominent situation is ending. Something that, you know, has taught somebody a karmic lesson. Somebody has learned a karmic lesson. And I think it's about love. It's about what love is. And what love is not. And I feel like somebody is getting some sort of epiphany, some sort of awakening that I need to go after this wish fulfillment I have been thinking about nonstop. I think we have somebody here that has woken up. It's like they've they've woken up. A secret's about to be revealed. If you go to my Facebook page, you will see that I posted a quote about two hours ago. Soul Source Tarot Facebook page. Things are about to get real. Something about a reality check three hours ago before I did this reading and that is exactly what we got things are about to get real really real there's a message that is going to come through that somebody has been waiting for 